Hello everyone, Phoenix Hill here, and welcome back to another Farming Simulator Phoenix Moment. <laughs> I forgot what these were called there for a minute. I mean, I haven't, I haven't done them. Well, <coughs> yes, that annoying cough still around, but I haven't. I, well, I did one last week. But anyway, anyway, welcome back to another one. As you can tell, I sound a whole heck of a lot better. Yeah. So there's that. That's a. I got that going for me. <laughs> I still got the cough, and you know, when I get to laughing, it, it's hard to, you know, it's hard not to cough. But other than that, I'm pretty good. And you know, a headache every now and then. Um, so this week should be back on schedule. Hopefully, cross my fingers. You know, hopefully we get back on schedule this week and uh, have some fun doing it. So um, first up, I gotta apologize for Friday night again because Friday night. My internet just decided, it, I think Comcast was working on it or something, and didn't notify anyone, because Comcast is awesome like that. Um, so, because I, I, after I finally just gave up trying to stream, um, I was sitting here, and I was watching my, my connection health in Discord, and it was just going red to green, red to green, red to green. And I did some speed tests, and my, my upload speed was anywhere between 0 0.25 to 8 megabytes per second, which I'm used to getting about 12. <laughs> so, you know, going from 12 to, yeah, just move JD's combine there. Going from 12 to 0.25 is no bueno, no bueno. And that's, that, that's probably what caused the internet cut crash um so that was all my internet that night i didn't realize that until doing a ton of research into it afterwards and like i said i think comcast has just decided they were going to work on the internet without telling anybody so there's that and it, it, it lasted literally for two hours after i, I quit streaming so i was dealing with just constant disconnection and all that. It was just a, it was a total chaos. Uh, Saturday though, not a single problem. Which, uh, it's, I don't know. Comcast, Comcast, Comcast. Um, but yeah, Saturday went great, smoothly, and it was just <sighs> absolutely fine. Now speaking of Saturday, Saturday I got rate it for the first time if you guys don't know what rating is it's where another streamer sends their viewers to your stream uh they they spam your chat with you know like the person that rated me his name sk so they were spamming chat with sk raid um there was a bit of confusion on when that happened uh a moderator of mine decided or well she didn't decide really she just kind of it, kind of instinct she saw spamming and she started timing people out when that comes into play the best thing to do is just ignore it and let it happen get the free views get the free subscribers you know, go about your business um and there was a whole big misunderstanding and i had to explain afterwards what the what a raid actually was and that it's not it's not necessarily a bad thing uh, unless you turn it into a bad thing so unfortunately, it got turned into a bad thing. But hopefully, if that ever happens again, it's all worked out. Uh, I did message the, the person SK and uh, explaining to him, you know, what was what transpired, and um, hopefully he accepts my apology because uh, <laughs> it was tr just truly 100% misunderstanding. Uh, and then Sunday came, and I didn't stream on Sunday because I had some things I had to do before uh, stream. And by the time I got done, I would only been on stream for like an hour. And I know a lot of people wouldn't really care for just an hour. So I just decided to not worry about streaming that night. And, um, well, because Ark, <laughs> Ark had me wrapped up in, uh, in it been playing on silent server so you probably see some videos of that coming here soon if you guys enjoy the arc stuff um hmm, i think that's just about it um for last week so on and so forth so this week um looking forward to this week we're gonna have 
try to be back on our normal schedule two videos a day uh, we, I might not get time to do a Dick Dynasty video today uh, it only depends on if I get time to record it or not I should but I'm not 100% certain um, Tuesday there will be a FS901 um, solo video and a Outcast State Trooper Wednesday will be a mod spotlight. A lot of people are like, is there going to be another mod spotlight? When's the next event mod spotlight? Mod spotlights should return this week. Um, I just, I hadn't felt up to doing this because those are the most, well, besides the CSGO videos, those are the most time consuming um, videos that I do. Uh, and Wednesday, either another Gang Beast or there is a new game out called Black Wake um, that I got a key for. That I'm really interested in. It's like a pirate game. Uh, you do battle with another ship and stuff. It looks pretty cool, so fingers crossed. It might be some of that footage um, Thursday, Outcat State Troopers, and I don't know what's going up after that. It might be Black Wake on Thursday and just do Gang Beast on Wednesday, like we've been doing. Um, and Friday, of course, is Let's Play, Let's Talk, which I still have plenty of topics to talk about. And. Um, Astroneer, which I'm having a ball playing. Uh, it's just a, it's just a fun game. Uh, Saturday, if we get time, there will be some Overwatch or CS:GO videos. I don't know which one, uh, but there will be hopefully some of that. So th that's shaping up to what to be the week. It, like I said, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Uh, and somebody's messaging me in Discord. <laughs> hopefully, we get back on track. Speaking of Discord. Um, our team speaks gone. Uh, I'm not even bothering with it anymore. I am super hooked on Discord. If you guys have not tried out Discord yet as a voice communication server, try it out. It's 100% free. You guys can have your own server, set it up just like TeamSpeak, but a whole lot more. Uh, there is some drawbacks like the whole uh, push to talk. and If you guys like the noise gate activation thing where you, it picks up your mic turns on at a certain vol volume. Um, from what I've been told, I, mean, I never use that, so. Um, but from what I've been told from some of the guys in Discord, it's a, it's a pain in the neck. Um, but if you use push talk, it's all good. Um, what else? Uh, which, I'm trying to think. Oh, and also the text chat, and it's amazing. You can upload files right to it. You don't have to upload the files to like Mediafire, Dropbox. You can share it right in that Discord. So I highly, highly recommend it. if you're looking for a voice communication server, Discord's the way to go. Uh, <laughs> I think all my friends have moved, like uh, Lady, she's moved to Discord, Silence moved to Discord. They both have their own rooms. Um, all the guys seem to be liking it, and you know I think we're just gonna stop our private team speak and just fully go Discord because uh, it is, it is very awesome, my friend, very awesome. Uh, Again, that is open to the public for you guys. There is, you're more welcome to join. Uh, I don't, I don't really have, like, I'm not going to share the link in every video if that makes sense. Um, if you guys go into the stream chats and uh, put exclamation point Discord, it will give you a link. You click on that link, poof, you're in. Um, but you're limited to what rooms you can get in. So, you know, you don't, while I'm recording, you don't pop in and spam me with a bunch of messages <laughs> so there, there's that there's that there's that um what else oh i'm happy to announce i'm actually gonna get on a, go on a vacation this year i've actually this is the first year since my sophomore no junior, sophomore year yeah sophomore year of high school that i'm able to go on a vacation um, the family and I are going away for a week, and it's going to be nice, it's going to be peaceful. What does that mean for you guys? Uh, you're just going to get just a simple video game upload for those days. You're, there's not going to be any of your typical, because I'm going to be leaving on Monday. Um, so you're not going to get any of your typical, you know, Phoenix Moments, Mod Spotlight, Let's Play, Let's Talk. I, there's not going to be any of that. Uh, might just be, you know, one video of a certain gameplay each day and then probably have I couldn't have second videos like uh, the Duck Dynasty or the 
uh, outcast state troopers stuff like that it's definitely outcast state troopers uh, still got a ton of that um, but that's not for another over a month and a half away so <laughs> there's still plenty of time you're still going to get fresh videos for the next few weeks calm down calm down um, yeah it's it's going to be going to be like I said about a month and a half away I think it's like 40 some days away so we're still playing time still playing time um, <clears throat> with that being said, I'm probably going to do some vlogging while I do it. I, 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 vlogging is a, a, a new thing for me. Um, so there will probably be, be some like vlog type videos of stuff we do while we're on vacation. Uh, I know we're going to be doing a lot of, of very cool stuff and I would like to share that with you guys. Um, Lastly, <laughs> I got a comment uh, on the last FS9 one that I did, and I'm going to address this in tomorrow's video too. So if you plan on watching tomorrow's FS9 one, you don't have to watch any further. <laughs> but um, I got a, a, you know, a comment on the FS9 one video talking about how we're grown men playing a children's game, which I'll just keep going. And uh, their six-year-old stumbled across the video and. Her they heard us cuss the parent heard us cussing and so on and so forth um so they they you know they trashed me and everything in comment sections but here's the thing i've never once claimed my videos to be children child friendly uh, my video is not available my videos are not available on the youtube children's app if you put that app on your your phone or your, your child's tablet my videos will not show up um, if you supervise your child <laughs> if you supervise your child when they're on YouTube watching videos they should not stumble across my video so if you want to trash me and my friends for playing a game which is not a children's game uh, this game is mainly played by more adults than, than children I can see where it, it draws the attraction of children, you know, especially with the FS nine one nine one series, because I know how excited Tyler is for it. Uh, well, it used to be for it, um, but my videos are not. I've even said it. I wouldn't watch. Let my kids watch my own videos. I I, we, I tried to be kid friendly a long time ago. It doesn't work. Cause we're grown men. Okay, we're a group of grown men that want to have fun and enjoy each other's company and that's what it comes out in there is a ton of foul language yes now be a parent and you know monitor your children online that's that's what i do my kid doesn't have access to youtube she has access to the youtube kids app which are all pre-screened by youtube and trust me still pay attention to what she's watching um, there are parental guides even on the computer like my kid watches YouTube on my PS3 there are parental controls where you can block certain channels you can block certain videos and stuff like that be a better parent and parent your child instead of blaming me and my friends for using or having foul language okay so yeah there's that <laughs> Sorry, that's probably going to be a, another let's play, let's talk topic because it, it so aggravates me when parents think it's okay. Like, this person actually thought it was super okay to trash me for for making videos that are not kids friendly, and her kid found the video. You know, he, how, why is that my fault for you being a sucky parent? So, thank you because you just proved that you are sucky in more than one way. Not only do you suck at YouTube comments, but you suck at being a parent. I know I'm gonna get trashed for that. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's this is how I feel. You know, you should monitor what you're. Even teenagers, Tyler should be monitored on what he looks up online. Okay, because I mean that's what led to the donkeys. Just saying. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But no, you should always. If, if you're a parent, you should always know what your kids doing online you know never let them just go and do whatever they please 
You know, you, you pay attention. So that way, when, you you know, little Johnny's watching YouTube, he doesn't stumble across Phoenix's FS911 where they're talking about donkeys. You know, but it's, it's that simple, guys. I'm going to stop rambling now. Uh, if you guys did like the video, be sure to leave a like down below. If you guys want to see future Phoenix moments, be sure to click subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.